The straw that broke the Cacodemon's back, though, was that recently Graph introduced untested code into GZ Doom that was generated by ChatGPT, which, to put it plainly, pissed off his fellow developers. Now, past the current societal debates on using AI to generate anything, let alone code, the chief issue with this, as seen by its developers, is that by introducing AI-generated code into GZ Doom, it could potentially jeopardize the engine's general public license, as AI-generated code cannot be copyrighted copyrighted, only code written by a human can, and because of that, games developed within GZ Doom could face legal scrutiny. This led to a heated back and forth between Groff and the other GZ Doom developers, resulting in him basically telling them, if you don't like it, you're free to fork it, as in, create your own version of GZ Doom. Again, this is an open source project, anyone is free to alter. And the other developers basically said, happily. And thus, work began on UZ Doom, or Uzi Doom as I like to call it. And it's essentially carrying on the work of GZ Doom minus Graph's involvement and the AI-generated code.